Who doesn't love to save money? And right now, who isn't living on a budget or looking for ways to save a buck? Hi, I'm Alicia Collins with the Alicia Collins Real Estate Team. We sell homes in the Casper, Wyoming area and surrounding Wyoming. We love to hear from you, so make sure you subscribe and comment below. People ask me a lot whether Casper is an affordable place to live. Yes, it is. And here are a few thoughts I have to why. Living within a budget in Wyoming can be a wonderful opportunity to embrace a simpler, resourceful lifestyle in one of the nation's most scenic and serene locations. With a blend of natural beauty, scenic landscapes, and some economic advantages for those looking to manage their expenses, Wyoming might be just the place for you. From embracing affordable living arrangements to capitalizing on the state's wealth of outdoor activities, navigating life in Wyoming on a budget can be an enriching experience filled with possibilities and financial stability. Living affordably here in my home of Casper, Wyoming involves a blend of resourcefulness, prudent decision making, connecting with our wonderful community and embracing the unique opportunities available in this vibrant city within the Cowboy State. From housing to daily expenses and recreational activities, several strategies can help residents manage their finances effectively while enjoying the charm and beauty of Casper. First, Wyoming is known for having a more tax-friendly environment compared to many other states in the United States. Here are some key points regarding lower taxes in Wyoming. No state income tax. Wyoming is one of the few states states that does not levy a state income tax. This means that individuals and businesses in Wyoming do not have to pay state income taxes on their earnings, which makes a big difference when it comes to living on a budget. We are among just a handful of states that do not impose a state income tax on our residents. In Casper and throughout Wyoming, we are able to keep more of our hard earned money. Low sales tax. Wyoming has a relatively low statewide sales and use tax rate of 4%. In Natrona County, there is an additional 1% sales and use tax. It's known as the one cent tax, making sales and use tax 5% within Natrona County. This tax is not permanent. It is voted on every four years and the revenues from this one cent tax benefit the cities and towns within Natrona County by funding numerous important improvement projects. There is no separate additional sales tax imposed by the city of Casper, which translates to lower overall sales tax burden for residents. No inheritance or estate taxes. Wyoming does not impose a state inheritance tax or a state tax, so inheritance and estates are not subject to state level taxation. Lower property taxes. While property taxes are assessed at the local level, Wyoming generally has lower property tax rates when compared to many other states. The exact rates can vary by county, but the overall property tax burden tends to be relatively modest. Business friendly environment. Wyoming is often considered a very business friendly state with favorable tax conditions for businesses. There are no corporate state income taxes and the state often provides various incentives to attract and retain businesses. It's not just taxes though. Casper, Wyoming stands out as a city that not only has amazing beautiful landscape and rich culture heritage, but also offers its residents a distinct advantage, a notably low cost of living. I've said it before, Casper is located in the heart of the Cowboy State and Casper provides a lifestyle that is most economically sustainable and appealing to those seeking financial stability. Here, we typically have a lower cost of living index compared to the national average. This index takes into account various factors, including housing, transportation, healthcare, and groceries, providing an overall measure of affordability. Of course, you know that being in real estate, I have to mention that the Casper housing market in 2023, that median home price in Casper, Wyoming was around 270,000, and the average home price was about 321,362. How does this compare to the rest of the nation? According to an article in the financial newsletter, the Motley Fool. At the end of September 2023, the median home sales price in the United States was 431000 up 4% 4 from June of 2023, and up a whopping 31% from the beginning of 2020, when the median sales price was 329000 Obviously, prices vary wildly from state to state, but our median sales price of 270000 seems really great when you compare it to Hawaii, the most expensive state to buy a house. Has a median home sales value of over 972,000. It is no surprise that the housing market in Casper is a large contributor to the city's overall affordability. The low cost of living extends to 
everyday expenses that go beyond affordable housing, including utility costs, which in Casper are generally reasonable, including natural gas, electricity, water, and other essential utilities that residents need for their daily lives. The average residential electricity rate in Wyoming in 2024 is 11.31 cents per kilowatt hour while the national average is 15.91 cents per kilowatt hour. Wyoming is the sixth best priced state in the country based on average electric rate. Many Casper residents, myself included, use pellet stoves in the winter to help heat our homes. This is a great option as an additional source of heat because the pellets are relatively inexpensive and many homes already have pellet stoves. Transportation costs, which are 10% lower than the national average and are also mitigated by the city city's manageable size and efficient road infrastructure. Here in Casper, most residents own their own vehicles, but we do have a limited but affordable public transportation system. The great thing about living in a small town is you don't have to travel far to get to where you're going, so commuting costs are relatively inexpensive. You may be surprised to learn that Wyoming's drivers pay 52% less than the national average for car insurance, according to a January 2024 article by Value Penguin, contributing to our lower transportation costs and overall cost of living in Wyoming. Wyoming has the lowest average cost of living among the Rocky Mountain states when compared to Colorado, Idaho, Montana and Utah, and is among the 20 most affordable states in the nation, according to a report published by MERIC. If you are a numbers person like I am, this is for you. According to the statistics from the report provided by rentcafe.com, the overall cost of living in Casper is 2% lower than the rest of Wyoming and 10% lower than the national average. Their report breaks this down further, showing that housing costs in Casper, both buying and renting, are 7% lower than the rest of Wyoming and 24% lower than the national average. Food costs in Casper are about 2% lower than the rest of Wyoming, but about 1% higher than the national average. And healthcare costs in Casper is about 3% lower than the rest of Wyoming and about 6% lower than the nationwide average. Utilities in Casper are 3% higher than the rest of Wyoming, but 14% lower than the national average. They even state that non-necessary expenses such as entertainment are about 3% less in Casper. This lower overall cost of living means that residents can stretch their dollar further when making everyday purchases. Casper's economic landscape, while diverse, does emphasize sectors such as energy, agriculture, and healthcare, contributing to a stable job market. Employment opportunities abound, allowing residents to pursue fulfilling careers without compromising their financial well being. Moreover, the city's business friendly environment attracts companies and entrepreneurs alike, fostering economic growth and job creation. It is also worth mentioning our energy sector con contributions. Wyoming's economic benefits from the energy sector, including coal, natural gas, and oil. This sector not only only contributes to job opportunities, it helps stabilize the economy. The presence of well-paying jobs in the energy sector can positively impact residents' ability to cover their living expenses while enjoying the, a reasonable standard of living. Beyond just economic advantages, Casper offers a high quality of life characterized by a strong sense of community, access to outdoor recreational activities, and a welcoming atmosphere. Of course, there's always tips for living on a budget that apply no matter where you live, like financial planning, shopping sales for items that you need, and maybe not purchasing every little thing you need. Well, not all the time anyway. What did I miss? Comment below and share your tips on you how you save money living here in Casper, Wyoming, or wherever your home is. Don't forget to subscribe so you never miss all the things we talk about, about Wyoming, Casper, and of course, real estate. We love talking to all of you, so reach out to us if you are coming to Wyoming. If you need a great real estate agent wherever you live, reach out to me and I will find the perfect agent for you. Remember, we want you to love where you live. See you soon.